hi everyone and welcome back to the channel the name is Mara today I will be checking out Mary with Children on season 2 episode 6 which is called girls just want to have fun I guess uh, well I didn't realize that this had a poor it was a two-part thing uh, I saw it when I was editing I was like oh it's a two part maybe that's why I felt like ooh, 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 ooh. okay maybe that's why I felt like it went by really fast um, but yeah it's a two part um, episode with that said uh, let's see if Mercy Marcy found her ring and how everything goes um, yeah You gotta get in Zoro's pants. Look, lady, we used to let women backstage until the big riot. Now nobody's allowed back there. We call it the Bundy Rule. Uh. I'll write Zoro a note, but this time I'll give him your phone number and address. That is, if you don't mind. Of sure, course. I don't mind. As long of as he course. comes over before uh, what's his name gets home from work. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks, Peggy. You really are the very best friend I've got. <laughs> <laughs> Wake up, honey. It's that time. Are you in the mood, honey? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah! Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> what? The bed is broken. The bed is broken. Oh, my gosh. Steve is gonna go crazy. My wedding ring is gone forever. But buy like a cheap one or something. He notices everything. You know what we do in bed sometimes? Yeah, Bud tells us. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. How you doing? Oh my gosh, that is Zorro. Actually, I'm looking for Marcy Rose. She live here? Practically. <laughs> I'm Raul. You know, uh, Zorro, Mel, you know, uh, suspicious. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, I'm an exotic dancer at Troy's. That's great. Uh, listen, I'd invite you in, but instead I think I'll just kick the crap out of you. <laughs> it's your fault you had to do it last night. Our wife's friend, Mrs. Rhodes, the one we call the tentacle. Okay. She lost her wedding ring down my pants during the show last night, and I'm just dropping it off to her. Okay, it doesn't make Come sense. <laughs> what can I offer you? Beer? Water? What? Listen, uh, so exactly what was this Marcy doing when she lost her ring? Oh my gosh, please. For our everlasting love, Stephen. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. Hi, Steve. Hi, Al. Uh, who's the guy in the black Porsche? Steve, how's Marcy doing? Is she still mad at you, buddy? No, I don't. Yeah, she is a special person. <laughs> anyway, here's her wedding ring that she lost down some guy's jock at a strip club last night. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Uh, yeah, I, I got it from the guy whose underpants they were wedged in. <laughs> I wouldn't worry about it, Steve. He's just some stripper named Zorro, and I'm sure it was nothing. Uh... Oh my gosh. I, in fact, uh, knowing Marcy as I do, uh, she probably lost it. <laughs> because as we all know, we're dirt and she's evolved. I can't believe it. My wife's ring. Oh, Steve. If I thought you were going to be upset, I never would have told you. <laughs> what you have there is what I like to call a get out of jail <sighs> food cart. She's got all this, and she goes to a strip joint. But getting back to something more important, how do we make her pay? Oh my god, ah! Yeah, I've done a good thing. Stupid. Stupid. <laughs> What's Troy's? You know, it's this place where I go with the girls and we sit and... Just how much of my money has found its way into the crotches of dancing oily... <laughs> what 
I know, Al. I don't count it. I just shove it in. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, she lies that much. From now on, I check eyes, teeth, vet bills, school books. And you know our joint checking account? I want to know what bank it's in. <laughs> you and Troy's are history. <laughs> Is that Zorro? I don't want you thinking about Troy. <laughs> you know, Steve, I think I've been too hard on you these past two days. Oh? <laughs> Nothing wrong with looking at another human being and appreciating their form. Oh? <laughs> this is so stupid. Oh, um, this came for you. Somebody dropped it off at Al's. So, uh, what was it? Coupons from Peg. So, you lost your ring down Zorro's pants, huh? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that was so petty. Uh, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know. That was really petty. Uh, yeah. She finally got a ring, but unfortunately, Al was home. Al, I don't know. Why does she, he hate Marcy? I, I don't get that relationship, but it's fun. Um, yeah, I think, I think when we saw Zoro in, uh, uh, Peggy's dream, if, oh, wait a minute, if Al was a good looking or had a body shape, I think that Peggy would actually be cooking, cleaning the house, fixing everything. Uh, it's just because Al is the way Al is that I don't think she cared that much. Um. But yeah, and he doesn't want to sleep with his wife. And I wonder, like, he seems like whenever they do it, at least she's happy. So he can. <laughs> so he can when he wants to. Uh, but he just doesn't want to. Okay, I, I get the picture. But any <laughs> anyways, this was a fun one. I thought that uh, Steve would tease Marcy a little bit. Like like the way he was thinking. Like mopping the floor with her hair. Or maybe cleaning. Or maybe cooking. Or make her feel bad. But maybe he would do it after this one. Because he knows the truth. Um yeah with that said uh, i don't know if no i think this was just part one and part two i don't, don't think there will be another part of this uh yeah with that said this was a nice episode um uh, with that said thank you guys for being here and i'll see you guys in the next reaction i'm gone bye bye peace